<laughs> all right, all right. I need to stop procrastinating. I need to start applying for jobs. Software engineer internships. Hmm. I don't want to work for no banks. Man, where the good jobs at? Ah, no wonder. I was searching in Canada. All right, jackpot. Bang jobs. Now this is what we're talking about. Now let's apply. 30 minutes later. I think that's good enough for today. Time to go back to TikTok. After over 68 rejections. Oh, uh, why is it so hard to get a friggin' job? Uh, maybe software engineering isn't for me. You got me. Uh, whoa, I actually got an interview. Hmm. Code monkeys. I don't even remember applying to this job. Oh well, an interview is an interview. The interview day. All right, today's the big day. I can't screw this up. And I came prepared today with my vodka lemonade. Ah, cheers. Let's finish this before I get way too lit. All right, looking fresh. Okay, wait, wait. Let's fix the headphones. All right, we ready to go. Let's go. Five minutes later. It looks like I'm pretty early, so I'll just wait a bit. Mm, so good. Hey, Vincent. Oh, hey, how's it going? Hey, I'm Matt, the CTO of Code Monkeys. Damn, how did he do that? Do these guys code in a jungle or something? Sorry for being a bit late. Is this still a good time to chat right now? Yeah, it's a good time. Thanks for taking the time to chat today. Let's get started. The question is very simple. This is something you'll probably see in your day-to-day -day working here. If you're given a list of words, can you find the unique occurrences of each word? Hmm, this question kind of sounds like that Jungle Book question. But that virtual background is so distracting, I can't focus at all. Hmm, or maybe I'm just nervous and I just don't know how to solve this question. Ah, uh, it is what it is, but the last thing I remember from class is using stacks. So let's go with that. Inside the list. Uh, yeah, so I think I can solve this by iterating through all the words, and I can probably use a stack to keep track of the words that I've seen. Wait, hmm, wait, 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 scratch that, scratch that. Actually, what I'll do is I'll use two lists. One list will keep track of the words that I've seen, and the second list will keep track of the occurrences of each of those words. Okay, interesting solution. But this is not what I'm looking for. This is way too damn slow. Hard to break it to you, buddy. But how long have you been coding? Um, I started in first year? So I'm about eight months in. So you're trying to apply for a summer internship, and you don't even know what a hash map is. Wait, why is this guy roasting me? Did he just mention hash browns? I'm actually pretty hungry, and I could definitely use a hash brown. Are you freaking kidding me? Man, what the heck are universities even teaching kids nowadays? Uh, the fundamentals? Even a boot camper who only has been coding for three weeks can solve this problem easy peasy. Alright, alright, I don't want to embarrass you anymore, so let's end it right here. Let's move on to something else. So, I had a chance to take a look at your transcript. Wait a second, I thought marks didn't really matter. It's not looking too pretty. Right here, it says that you have 68 in your logics and computation class. <laughs> and I guess that pretty much explains why you don't know what a hash map is. Well, I'll give you the benefit of the doubt. Can you explain why you got such a low mark? Well, long story short... I was very burnt out that semester, and that class was very difficult. The prof was reading off the slides, and even the prof didn't even know what he was talking about. I also had my own mental health to deal with, like I was going through depression and- Alright, alright, stop, 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 stop. You know what? I don't need your background story. You don't need me to feel any pity for you. At Coding Monkeys, we need Coding Monkeys. And I just don't think you fit in. You're not going to be a good culture fit either. So I'm a very busy man, and let's save both of us some time. Let's end it right here. Um, okay... But you can apply again next year, after you make sure your marks are higher, and also after you learn about hash maps. Anyways, back to coding for me. Thanks for watching guys, this was actually based on a true story, but some parts may have been exaggerated.